Hey, uh, YouTube friends and family, welcome back to AZ Triumpster. So, uh, I'm up here at Arrowhead Harley Davidson, as you can tell. And uh, I confirmed that the 2020 Lowrider S is back here, and I figured we could get a better look at it now. Since there's not a band playing 30 feet from us, and, uh, and maybe get a comparison here. So, let's uh, hop inside and see what's going on. Alright, let's see what we got going on in here. Oh, right on. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, what's up, Brad? Welcome back. Good to see you, man. Hey, you too. So, uh... Here they are. Nice. In all their glory. So, uh, what do we have in front of us? What are we looking at here? Uh, let's start with mine. This is your bike? This is mine. Okay. My baby. 2017 Dyna Lowrider S. The last of the Dynas. The king of the Dynas. Uh-huh. Uh, I've done a little work to it. Obviously, I've raised it up. Uh, pipe intake, a little bit of top secret motor work. Top secret. Bearing bars. All the things to make it mine. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, yeah, that's a beautiful a bike, man. Bike. 2017, huh? 2017. The last of the twin cans. The last of the diamonds. Yeah, you definitely got a lot of work into it. Did, did the wheels come that color? To match the color, I absolutely love the rim color. There's a little, my Dean speed shifter down there. Oh yeah, let's not forget that. Ooh yeah. Love that. Right on. on Alright, so, uh, big question is, what are we looking at over here? Over here. So, they've outdone themselves. Uh, this is the new Softail Lowrider S. Uh, they definitely sort of kept the aesthetic. Um, uh, the, the bronze colored rim. Um, it's they they kept with the uh, the performance sort of thing. So uh, big difference between the two is obviously going to be the frame. Uh, this has got the dual shock. Now we've gone to the mono shock. Right, and that's a, yeah, it's right under the seat, right? Right under the seat. Gigantic improvement. Um, the the frame in its entirety. It's more than just that the uh, the mono shock. The yeah. whole frame is lighter, it's stiffer, it's more nimble. I mean, they really, they really knocked her out of the park with this one. Uh, another big difference you're going to notice right off the bat is they inverted the forks this year. Still dual disc, which is um, sort of the hallmark of the lowrider. Yeah. Um, dual disc brakes, but nice. inverted forks this time. So with that mono shock and those inverted forks, man, this thing is really going to handle. Uh, the other major difference is obviously going to be this new Milwaukee 8, the 114. 114. Um, that, if you haven't ridden it, you should come down and ride it because that model, that motor is a monster. Now, now yours is a 110, but it, you've got some work done to I've it. Done a little top secret work to it. Yeah, to um, say the least. And, and so it's yeah, it's a ripper, um, but there's no doubt about it. This 114 uh, will eat my lunch. Yeah. Even with the work. Even done just to it. Yeah, just completely bottom. stock, really. That's incredible. It, it really is a beautiful bike. Well, I mean, I know the uh, I know the 107 is uh, from my slim, and I love it. Um, but having the, uh, the extra displacement and the uh, inverted forks and the dual front discs, I bet you can just race so I this thing. Tell people, uh, th this beauty was the best performing bike Harley's ever made, and I was right. It really is. Okay. So, if, you know, for for those who like to ride hard, uh, that's the one right there. Man. That's sweet. Absolutely gorgeous bike. Well, man, I appreciate you taking the time and uh, yeah, no worries. And talking about uh, your beautiful motorcycle here and yeah, uh, in the new off. 2020. Anytime I get a chance, and you know, if people want to come down here and. Uh, take a look at this new lowrider s they won't be disappointed it's a monster so since you speak so highly of the new one when are you going to trade up i think i'm going to add to the collection oh really i hope my wife doesn't see this <laughs> no. uh, but especially now that i've pulled this i pulled them side by side like this the first time i've done this i just can't help but think how good these two bikes would look in my garage so, yeah uh, I, I think there's a real possibility of it. nice man well 
Uh, guys, you heard it uh, here hopefully first, and if not, then uh, not too reasonably late, that uh, Arrowhead Harley-Davidson Peoria, Arizona has the 2020 uh, Lowrider S uh, at least come in and take a look and have Brad Topper show you around. Uh, hit that subscribe button, go ahead and like the video, and as always, ride safe, guys.